Hello and welcome to an episode of Is This A Brand Deal? I don't know. Let's jump right into it. So I got given this package by this company called Ava Hair. Actually, I'm really hoping it is this because otherwise... So since my hair YouTube videos, I got contacted by this company. And I'm not gonna lie, I didn't think it was legit because the email had a lot of spelling mistakes in it and, you know, it just didn't seem very um, legit. This has my address on it. Yeah, basically I got this email saying, do you want some wigs? They sent me this about a month ago and basically they wanted to give me a wig for Halloween so I could dress up. And I didn't respond to the email until about two weeks ago because, I, in fact, I responded like two days before Halloween. I was just like, you know, what's the harm in replying even if it's not real? And basically I sent them my address and they sent me this. That's basically all that's happened. And they told me some things that I needed to do. And I don't know if I have to do these things or not because I have never done this before. Ava Hair has 198,000 followers on Instagram so I was like, you know what, this would be pretty cool if I get free stuff from this brand that apparently a lot of people know about. So I was like, send me some stuff along. So yeah, basically this is the wig that I've been sent apparently. So now I'm just gonna go and get changed, put some makeup on and get ready for this video and then we're gonna unbox the wig and see what happens. I've never worn a wig before other than this Ooh. stupid one that I wore for Halloween. So this should be exciting and fun. Welcome to my channel by the way, my name is Lucy Lynch. As you can tell I don't know what I'm doing yet. Who does really? Who knows what they're doing in this world? Okay so the weirdest thing just happened. I'm like mid doing my makeup right now. Um, and I just got this other package in the mail and I have no idea what it was so I thought you know I just turn on the camera to open it I mean to be honest it could be anything and it's got like a handwritten address on it so honestly who knows um, it's, I honestly have no idea what this is gonna be it looks cute though it could be a present from somebody I don't know what the fuck? I don't recognise the handwriting on it. Uh oh, I'm damaging it. Where is this from? I don't I don't know what this is. I feel like this is a gift from someone. What the fuck? This is such a sidetrack, I'm sorry. I, it's ah, oh, it's food. It smells like food. It's cake. What the What the fuck? Wait, what? What is this? Chocolate. Oh, it smells amazing. It smells really good. Yeah, there's no message. There must be a note there's no at the bottom. There's, no the there's nothing. There's absolutely nothing in here. Oh my god. Whoa, whoa, okay, whoa, whoa, right. Whoa, whoa, so whoa, whoa, I'm going to turn off the camera and I'm going to try and find out what this happened. I'll, I'll, I'll let you know. Okay, so now I've got a ton of shit on my face and I feel disgusting. Let's open the wig. Also, if you want to know how I did this look, it's in one of my past videos. It's like two videos ago. It, I will link it up here. It's called something about caking your face. Cool, anyway, let's open this because that's what we came here for, isn't it? Right, so hopefully this is the wig, otherwise this is the most anticlimactic video ever. Also, turns out that those chocolates were from my mum. It's just, there was supposed to be a letter in it and there wasn't, so yeah. Also, yeah, my makeup is terrible. Like, it looks fine from a distance. Like, here probably looks okay, to be honest. I don't really know. But if you zoom in, yes, my eyeliner ran out halfway. So we've got, like, half a wing thing going on. And no, I couldn't be bothered to do it in my eyebrows because I hate my eyebrows. I also mentioned that in the video that I've linked up there. It is Ava hair. <laughs> so it comes in this cute little box, which I get, I think I kind of destroyed. But, yeah. Oh, and here she is. I really know nothing about wigs, as I said before. Apparently I need to talk about the stike of the wig, but I don't know what that is, so that's gonna be fun. I will do some Googling. Honestly, I don't know why I got given a free wig, but I got given a free wig that was apparently worth $105, so here she is. I mean, already I can see that it's actually, to be honest, quite good quality, like compared to Wait, let me get my uh, Halloween wig that was like £10. So here we have this fun thing. And then we have this. Yay. I'm kind of scared. I 
don't really know what I'm doing and it's this is really long. I need some instructions. I might have to watch a tutorial. I have a wig cap, two wig caps, two wig caps. It looks like a pair of tights. So we need to get this bad boy out. It's like too big for my camera frame. I'm scared. I don't want to break it. So apparently I need to keep it stored in the net. I should probably read some information about this wig. It's cute though. It's really cute. I can't, oh. It's got some clips on the inside. Um, like this. And it's, I know it's a lace front and I know that, well I'm pretty sure that you have to cut this lace around your forehead. Um, yeah. But honestly I need to know more about this so I'll be right back. Description of this wig is ombre grey silver colour, gorgeous long wavy style, high temperature resistant silk, and it's 28 inches. That seems about right. It won't fit in my camera frame, so 150% heavy density apparently. Cap construction, lace front, back, weft, glueless cap with sew in combs. Overhead's website is actually kind of good, like it has some video tutorials at the bottom and it has like realistic photos that people have posted of them wearing the wigs. I'm just gonna click on this video on how to apply a synthetic lace front wig and learn. Okay so there's another really cool thing that I just learned about this as well. There's these, there's clips here so you can adjust how tight the wig is around your head which seems really cool to me to be honest. Okay so I feel like I know everything that I need to know now to wear a wig. What this girl did was she put the wig on and decided whether or not to cut all the lace off. So I'm gonna do that. Um, yeah. So I have a really small forehead so I don't know what this is gonna be like, not gonna lie. Also in the video the girl like cut some of the hair off and I don't feel like I wanna do that. So I'm just gonna cut round the hairline of the wig. I'm gonna put the bald cap on. Well the wig cap, not the bald cap, whatever. I feel like this is gonna make my forehead look even smaller than it already is. <laughs> Got my little shaved bit just down here, grown out strong. I'm gonna get so many comments on this video like, girl, you're doing it so wrong. You don't know what you're doing. No shit, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm learning, okay? And I'm actually doing research this time. Everyone was like, oh, why didn't you do research before bleaching your hair? Cause YOLO, you know? Plus I think this is quite a good look by itself, you know? And also I've seen people put on their wigs like upside down, like they go like this. Is that the way you're meant to do it? I feel like that's gonna mess up. You know what? I'm gonna follow what everyone else does and I'm gonna flip my hair and I'm gonna flip it upside down and I'm gonna flip my hair back. Wow, yeah, that really worked. Going well, lad. So it turns out I was a massive idiot and didn't realize that it was a side parting wig. So already it looks a lot better. Okay, so I've just pushed the clips in. There's two on the sides and one on the top. I'm bobby pinning it at the front. And then I'm gonna get some black eyeshadow and go over the lace. Been quite a while now. I've watched so many tutorial videos on it now. Basically I didn't have it anywhere near far forward enough so I've pulled it forward, I've pegged it down, I've bobby pinned the flaps down and now I'm just gonna go over this hairline with some concealer and then I'm pretty much done. So the thing is, so everything is fine. The only thing I'm having an issue with is that there's just so much hair. So I'm gonna like try and do something about that, maybe put half of it up. I honestly think like this is such a good wig. I just think I'm really incompetent. It, it's like such good quality and the fact that it's like the lace front and you can cut it out and like customize it yourself. I'm gonna link over here down below with all their details. If you are interested in purchasing one of their wigs, they have uh, like so many types of wigs like pages and pages I was scrolling through their wigs for ages and also you can get 20% off if you use the coupon code Lucy Lynch. I think the hairline looks really good but it's super secure like I didn't think that wearing a wig would be this secure so I'm just gonna try and style it now 
get back to you. Yeah. So I'm actually starting to really enjoy this wig now. It's just really fun being able to play around with it. But honestly, like, I think it's such a nice wig. Like, I love the colour. I love the style, I love everything about it. Shout out to Ava Hair for messaging me like I don't know why you did, but thank you. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a like down below or feel free to subscribe to my channel. And if you liked this wig or would like to know more about Ava Hair, then the links will all be in the description along with my social media. And also, as I said earlier, if you wanted to get 20% off, 20% off, like think about that, that's quite a lot of money. If you're buying a hundred pound wig, that's 20 pounds off. You know, quite decent. 20% off coupon code Lucy Lynch. Yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Bye. Here we go. I just want to show you the difference between where I've brushed it and where I haven't brushed it here. <laughs> just because I didn't really think about brushing it. Like, it was getting really knotty, but I didn't really think to brush it because I thought it might brush out the curls. But I was like, oh, the video's over. Like, I'll just do it now anyway. So I brushed it and actually it's so soft. I can't even explain. Go!